That's, that's a good fish. Oh, that was so cool. That was beast. Way bigger than what I've been catching so far. All right, what is going on, guys? Hope you're all doing well. So today I'm out on a boat, first time in a while, um, and yeah, I'm on one of one of my favourite pike lakes. Super shallow, big lake. Today it's really clear. No, there's a bit of colour in the water, but yeah, clear water, shallow water. Springtime, super fun fishing, but in winter it's like incredibly difficult you could go spring 20 30 fish a day and then in winter you're looking to get two or three so we're going to grind it out today in winter i've got the lure rods i've got the dead bait rods as well for a change um and yeah we're just going to see if we can figure them out see if we can catch some fish it's uh yeah not gonna be easy we've got like nine hours to fish um yeah nice overcast condition we've got high pressure still which makes things difficult but we're gonna see what we can do we've got pretty much Every type of lure that you can think of, hard baits, soft baits, jerk baits, swim baits. Got a bunch of different dead baits. The one thing we don't have, uh, which is a bit annoying, is an anchor. So we're just going to spend the whole day drifting and trawling. Um, but yeah, I don't mind doing that to be fair. I do like anchoring in some hot spots where I know fish usually hang out. But while it's quite calm like it is now, if it stays like this, we should be able to hover in the areas decently anyway. So. Yeah, let's get fishing. Hopefully we'll catch some fish. Um, I'm kind of confident. I'm confident we'll get some. My goal today is, uh, I will, I'll say this, I was speaking to the guy at the boathouse uh, and he said everyone struggled on Sunday, which is the last time someone was out. Uh, the most fish that was caught was four. So my goal is four fish or more, uh, which shouldn't be too hard in nine hours, I say. But yeah, we'll see what happens. Four fish. Um, some nice ones have been coming out as well. I'll show them some pictures. So, fingers crossed for a big one. But I'm happy with anything today. So, yeah, let's get cracking. That's fish. That's fish. We're straight in. Oh no! No! Oh man! Well, we've been fishing like 20 minutes and there was a fish. Freaking popped the hook though. How little aggressive little guy that. On the brightly coloured jerk, who would have thought it? Yeah, middle of winter. Absolutely freezing cold. And we miss a little guy on a super aggressive bright orange and yellow jerk bait. Hey, that's got my hopes up that though. Little fish, but any fish is a good fish in January. I've said it in every single video I've filmed this month, but any fish is a good fish in January. Definitely drift back over this area then. Probably a few more of them. I mean, it was like a three pound pike. But, yeah. I'd rather get 10 three pound pike than no pike. What's that be my only bite of the day now? First 20 minutes of fishing. <laughs> Leave some decent pauses on this jerk. Right, fish it aggressive between pauses, but yeah, two or three seconds at least. Full of dew. Oh no. 10 minutes of this switch put a swim bait on and then switch to something else and then switch to something else and keep doing that but i did have that first hit on this so i'm going to stick with this for now there's another oh i missed another that followed it right off it just whacked it then no that was another hit straight on it That's a fish on the jerk. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. It's not a big fish. Oh, yes. That slammed me when I least expected it then. Oh, let's go, baby boy. First fish, it's a monster. Need a touch, it's official. We've caught a fish. 
<laughs> it's smaller than the other two that hit to be fair, but uh let's fish. Let's freaking go. Let's go straight back up to that same spot. I did not take too long at all, maybe an hour fishing. Hour and a bit. I was just looking and watching my dead bait float and then bang, red tip. Felt actually a lot bigger than it was that fish, but Whew, I'll take her, I'll take her. That's the day started. Two missed, one landed. Plenty more to come, hopefully. I'd say I've still got probably eight hours of fishing left, so <laughs> we uh, we should get another fish. Hopefully bigger than that one, but that's the starter. That is the starter. Fingers are getting freezing. I'm struggling to do the clutch on this. I might have to switch to fix four. If uh, it gets any worse. Probably a lot. There's another one. There's another one. That's a little bigger, I think. Oh yeah, it's a little bigger. Oh yes. They are on it, bro. They are on it. <laughs> Yoink, leader to that's fish two. Fish two in the boat. January jerk baiting, baby. Okay, there we go. Hooks out. Tight number two. Another beautiful looking one. Must have got a bit of a bite or something in his back. Yeah, lovely colours on that. Clear water pipe, man. They're getting bigger. Okay. <laughs> Can't believe the action we've had already. Two fish. Three missed. Two landed. That was a good start. Jack's, but some good spot at this time of year is always nice. I'm fishing quite quick to be fair. I've sped up my uh, retrieve speed. They seem to respond to that pretty well. Um, but you gotta remember, we are drifting towards the bait. So I'm fishing, if I was bank fishing, I'd be fishing slower than this. And the lure would be getting retrieved at the same speed, if you get what I mean. But we are. Drifting at probably right now, three quarters of a mile an hour, something like that. So, got to take that into account. You don't want to fish at the same speed you'd be fishing if you're stationary because your lure would just, uh, yeah, sink to the bottom. Probably not too many big mammas around where the jacks are because the pike, the bigger pike in this lake, primarily live off jacks. Um, <laughs> But there's another one. Oh, did you see that? Oh, ho, 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 ho. that's a better fish as well. That was so cool. Oh man. See that, when I say I felt that bump on the, the thing and it wasn't a proper bite, exactly like that, you just saw it came, it hit it with its mouth open, but it didn't bite it. It just hit it, stopped, swam off. Saw me that one, obviously, but that's the same when you feel a bump like that, they come off smash into it but they don't like full on commit to it but man that one stormed up for it then that was a better fish that was the best one i've seen so far waste time bringing dead baits today that's for sure because they are not going to be eating them oh man that was so cool <sighs> i forgot how exciting this is man i was expecting i was expecting not to see a fish till midday i'm not gonna lie but Oh, we're getting a few bites. This jerk is doing it. Ross Thomas Custom. Uh, how long have we had this now? Two years maybe? See, I think this lake is the first place I fished with it. And I think between me and Ross we had 34 fish to the boat. Which is why I put it on here because I know that they, uh, they really like it in this place. But didn't expect to be doing some jerk traction today. I honestly was thinking I was going to be slogging away with the big softies all day but if they're taking jerks I'm all over that you can't be a bit of jerk bait fishing or glide bait fishing whatever you want to call it the reason I went straight for this bright colour as well I mentioned it before with the dark lures and the bright sky but bright lures losing my voice for some reason but <laughs> bright lures low light conditions you get that better standout you get a better silhouette 
better chance of the pipe seeing it you know you have to that contrast to the sky you know we've got perfectly clear water you know we're over two meters and i can see the bottom super easy where we are now um but yeah in my opinion anyway low color do it for as an official <laughs> just as i'm chatting nonsense uh but yeah low color this feels bigger as well low color do it for the conditions rather than the water yeah this feels like a better fish unless it's hooked weird it could be a nicer one though this could actually be a good fish i've not felt any head shakes there we go there's the head shakes could be a nice one is it uh no it's a little guy <laughs> Just a strong fighter. Fish number three though. Need a touch. That slammed it and that was cool as. There we go. Number three on the jerk. It's only a uh, you know, 65, 70 here, but I'll take it. Beauty looking colours again. Perfect little clear up bike. See babe. Try to get a cast at that same spot. I forgot what I was talking about, low colour or something, but <laughs> there's a fish. Slammer. Three down in quick succession then, like, so good for this time of year. Again, nothing big, but a lot of fun. Oh, follower. Just a little dude, followed it right to the boat then. First one I've seen for probably 15, 20 minutes. Oh man, I hate it when they follow just to the boat and then stop. Oh man, it's freaking cold out here. There's another one. <laughs> Boat side, baby. Look at him reeling. There's number four. Watch that take it then. It was a slow ass take, but it's number four. There we go. Hooks out. Fish number four. Another 60, 55er. Whatever size it is, it doesn't matter. We've got our goal of four fish already. Two hours into fishing, or two and a bit hours into fishing now. Oh, it was cool to see that boat side then. Just watched him sneak up behind it and uh, yeah, just pounce on it. Looks bigger when it hit. <laughs> I'll take one of that size. There's a fish, there's a fish on a fast drift. This feels massive. Just pulling the bow round. This might, I said this before, but this is actually pulling the boat around this fish. I know it's a small one again. <laughs> How did that pull the boat round then? Oh man, dead weight. That's fish five though, wow. What a start to the day. Well guys, just landed pack number five. It's not a monster at all, but uh, I'll take that in January, no problem. Absolutely smashed that jerk down in the shallow water. So much fun. Get this geezer back, get another one caught. There we go, nice easy knock in. Little 70, but I'll take it. See you babe. Oh, powered up. I started today thinking I was going to get like two or three bites there and we're up to probably ten contacts, five fish landed. Well happy. All in this beauty, bright orange, bright yellow, custom jerk, but well, does the job. Let's get it back out, let's get some more caught. Follow it. He missed it, he missed it, he missed it. 
God damn. Twist it just at the wrong time then. Eh? Oh, again. Okay. Twice he just lunged it. Just swiping at it rather than uh, trying to nail it. Oh, again, man. That's four times now. I'm pretty sure that's the same fish. It's got the worst game in the world. Again. Five times now. Follow after follow after follow. There's a fish there, that one's pinned. Finally got one to commit. <laughs> oh, that's a better one as well. That's probably the best one out today. Oh. Is it? Uh, yeah, it is a better fish. Oh, I can't get my clutch because my finger's dying. Yeah, that's the best one today. Oh, that's a decent pike. That is a decent pike. Go on, don't come off, don't come off, don't come off. It's like a musk in the water. Oh my god, no. No, no, no. What have I done? I pinned it on the net. God damn it. Okay, it's in the net. That was so awkward. God damn it. Well guys, got fish number six in the net. It's not a giant, but it's definitely the best one of the day. It's a double figure pike anyway. Beast. Way bigger than what I've been catching so far. I don't think it's gonna go a meter, it's probably a 90. Um, but yeah, on the jerks, when we've been catching jacks and everything else has been followed, this guy nailed it, that was so good. Yeah, it's a 90, 91. So yeah, like I say, Good fish for this place in 91. I'll uh, yeah, get it back. That was awesome. <laughs> Beauty. My hands are so cold. Oh, oh, oh. There she goes. Straight back down. Such an awkward netting job. Well, that's fish number six. Just as the wind's picking up as well. Perfect. Oh, nice to get a decent one on the board. Yes. Okay, we've drifted a fair way now, but get casting again. Got my confidence back up with some more fish, that bad boy. Beauty. Got my confidence up that we can actually get some decent ones as well. I thought it was just gonna be a pure jack fest today, but nice double. 91 centimeters, like I say, 12, 13. 14 at a push, maybe. Decent fish, though. Same jerk I've had them all on. After just having about 12 follows off jacks as well. Another jack just followed it. Very nice guy, but he's on it still. He swiped it four times then. And he's took it. Two fish and two casts, baby. Two fish and two casts. <laughs> there we go, leader touch, that's number seven. There we go. Fish seven, beautiful. See babe, I'm gonna get cast back out as fast as I can. That one swiped it, it must have been six or seven times before I actually made a contact with the lure. Oh man, another one. They are so aggressive. These strikes are not feeding strikes there. Pure aggression. That looks like a, a better fish, than, like not a big one, but better than you know the 60s that we've been getting most of the day. There's a fish. There's a fish. It's a tiny one. <laughs> I was just thinking I've not had a follow or anything on this uh, on this drift. Nah. There we go, that's fish number eight. 
little guy, but um, I'll take him. I'll take him. Come here, baby. I to get well up, buddy. There we go. Fish. Eight. Beauty. See you, buddy. See ya, buddy. Oh. Yeah, it's been a slow drift, this one. Just That's the first contact I've had. No follows. The other drifts I've had. Tons and tons of follows on. So... Hopefully I'm getting to a few fish here. There's another. That's him. Heavy. Oh no, it's off. Oh, that one felt really heavy then. Oh, it's just been slow. That's second contact. Yeah, that felt solid again, that fish. Similar place where I had the other decent one as well. Damn it. Oh. Another contact there, another contact. Alright guys, I didn't have my camera on, but I was just drawing with this uh, swim bait, this hard swim bait that's kind of like a jerk bait really, uh, and it just got smashed. So I'm going to start my drift here. Well, kind of where I was going to start anyway, to be fair. Big old troll without any contacts on it. Uh, yeah, I got hammered. Dodo, not used a dodo in ages. All right, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna switch to the orange though. That's where I've got the confidence in today. The wind has totally changed direction, which is mega, mega annoying. Just can't drift on the same line that I've been drifting down all day, but I just have to stay down here with the motor, use the motor to send me in the direction that I wanna go. It's annoying, but it's whatever. Just hope I can run into some more fish. Still trying to get up to double figures. Run eight. Ain't too bad to be fair. For a morning. I don't think it's even 12 o'clock. There's another one. Just as I'm chatting nonsense. <laughs> First cast back in this spot. Easy bro, they're so fired up man. Absolute madmen. Go ahead, buddy old pal. Okay, there's number nine. <laughs> Hooks down. Okay, the colours on these are stunning. Look at like even the red on the, the uh, gill rakers is like proper vivid red. Awesome, awesome fish. Ooh, see bro. It's not big, but uh, yeah, stunners and aggressive. So much fun, man. That's number nine. Okay, one more and we're up to ten. It's not a counting lesson, but. <laughs> I have to keep telling myself because I always forget how many I've caught. Alright, seeing as the wind's changed, we're going to fish over some new ground. I've done quite well over this bit, I'm going to drift in the past, so we'll see if they're there today. If not, we'll just go back over the areas where I've been catching. Pretty confident that we'll get them in different places though. I mean, I've been picking fish, odd fish up everywhere I fish, to be honest with you, so I think I think they're just very spread out. There's, there's a few areas where I've been getting a higher density of fish, but yeah, it's not like they've been stacked in any one particular spot like they are free spawn, post spawn. So yeah, we'll do this drift. If we don't pick anything up, we'll just come back up to the top and drift over areas where I have picked fish up. So yeah, basic. See what happens. Perfect ground, like the other spots where I've been picking up, it's like the deeper areas of the lake, which is like two meters. And there's still weed on the bottom as well, which is what the pike seems to be hanging around. Follower. Oh, big follower as well. You wet blanket. That a nice fish. Double figure five, easy. Oh, damn. At least I've seen fish in this area, but why did it follow? <laughs> Just munch it next time, bros. If tasty morsel. <sighs> okay, okay, another follower then to add to the the pile of fifty followers that we've had today. 
Oh, another follower just turned to the boat again. Getting cautious, these boys. I mean, I've not, this, this area has not been fished over today, but seen two fish and they both just followed. That one's took it. That's a decent one as well. That's a decent one. It's not a monster, but it's a decent fish. Come here, baby. Oh, don't thrash like that. <laughs> Come on. Man, they've got so much power in here. They never normally fight this hard. Oh, I watched that one come up and smack it, and that was cool. We're in the net. Okay, second biggest of the day. It ain't a giant, but it's the second biggest of the day. Okay, guys, pike number 10 in the boat. Second best of today. It's no monster, but it's a beauty. Absolutely went wild, this fish. Got a weird red thing on its eye as well. That's something I've never seen before, but yeah, beauty. Number 10, baby. Get his back, hopefully get some more. Watch that one follow up and smash it, that was so cool. But uh, yeah, I'll have that. It's like a weird bit of red. Oh, I think it would chip a paint off the jerk actually, but yeah, we'll get this guy back. <sighs> See you, baby. Number 10. Yeah, I was really confused with that, what around that fish's eye then. Because um, it looked like a uh, gill raker colour. So I was like, is one of his rakers, you know, deformed through his eye? But now it's just a chip of paint off this. <laughs> <sighs> oh man. That was awesome. Glad I did this different drift then. Here's to another 10 pike in the boat. And I must have had contact with 30, 40 different fish maybe. Including follows. That's a nice one again. That's a nice one again. That was so good. Babe. That was so good. Oh yes, that looked awesome. Such a good hit that one. About the same size as that last one, I just got to be fair. Oh, tail slapper. <laughs> oh man, there's such strong fish in here. At this time of year anyway. Okay guys, fish number 11. Smack that jerk hard. About the same size as that one I just had really, which is above average for this place. So yeah, well happy with that, get him unhooked. I might get a length just to see how big it is, probably about 80. Yeah, spot on with that guess, 82. 82 centimetres, so about the same as that last one. So we've had two 80s, a 90, and a bunch of 60s and 70s, so sweet. See your home boy. Or home girl, should I say, maybe. Oh, okay, yeah, this drift, this drift was good. Whacked it, that one slapped it so hard out there. Not as big as those last year, but it doesn't look terrible. Proper good hair. <laughs> and there's a dead sailor in. What? That was super cool. That. Yeah, just a little wiener. Come here, baby boy. <laughs> oh, again, it's so freaking aggressive, man. Okay, okay, quite okay. well. See you, Really good hit, that though. Really good hit. Again, I keep, I keep just wanting to turn the boat around and start the drift, and then I get another hit or another follow or something. I guess I'll just keep going. Oh, 
Oh. First bite on this drift for a couple of follows. I think I bumped that one off actually because I went to jerk when it hit. Damn it. At least I got a hit though. That's okay again. Damn it. Oh, it's gone. It was tangled. It, just, it took it where it was tangled. Absolute mad guy. Mad guy. I might come back that one then. Hit that like three times when it was tangled then. There's another one. Yes. Ooh, finally. It's like an hour since the last fish. Lady it counts, it counts, it counts. It counts. <laughs> yeah, I just had a little um, break for five minutes. Try and warm my hands up. First cast back and whoosh, little guy nailed it. There we go. Like 13, a bit of an awkward one looking, but another beautiful, perfect looking fish. Such nice clothes on there. Hang it over. Here it goes, 13. Now my hands are cold again. <laughs> Thought I wasn't going to get another fish. It's been so slow for the last, like say, hour. A few follows here and there, but not much going on. Hopefully, that means it's starting to switch on back on again. I can get a few more. Two more fish to get up to my new goal, which was 15. <laughs> I've still got about two hours of fishing left, so should get there easily, to be fair. We'll see, we'll see what happens. If not 13 fish in a day in January, ain't bad going. Ain't bad going at all. I think, uh, more people are after I'm after with 13 fish on best time of year for fishing. Never mind on the artist, so yeah, well happy. Right, one more cast on this drift I think, and I'm gonna go back on hammer the hot spots. There are there is fish here but not as many as I've seen up there, so I'd rather well, it's hard to spend time in areas where I know there's more fish to be had. Ooh, right, gonna have to change the trolling motor batteries in a minute. The Rebel settles on 1%, but well, it's 3 o'clock now, I've been out with it for 8 hours. And I've been hammering it as well, and it's lasted this long, which is mad. So, do a few casts around here, and then I'll swap batteries. But yeah, 8 hours. Wait, eight hours is it? Yeah, eight hours. Mental. Eight hours and the big lead ones, that one up there, they normally last four hours. So it's a crazy, crazy difference. That really, to be fair. I uh, fish it just like exactly the same way. Doing a bit of, uh, bit of trolling, a bit of drifting and stuff. So yeah, crazy how um, much longer that lithium one lasts in comparison, you know size wise that's like five kilo the other one's 30 kilo so yeah worthwhile investment if anyone's thinking about getting a lithium battery way way better than the lead ones and most of them the rebel cell ones anyway come with a 10 year guarantee so it's yeah gonna last you a lot longer most lead ones uh start losing power way before that But yeah, I'm back up where I missed some pint now, so hopefully they're back on the munch around this area. Ooh, baby. God damn. Another gentle boat side hit. Oh, another follow. Ah. Why don't you just smash it, bro? You've already committed to following, just smash it. 
this last hour is going to be hard two more fish to get to get to my 15 target thought it was going to be easy uh, a lot, a lot, an hour and a half ago but now I think I might struggle to get that two more fish, that's all I need there we go, there we go that's the same one, I came back for it <laughs> let me get that lead up uh, lead a touch, number 14, okay number 14 <laughs> Oh man, that took some going. This guy will fired right up then now. Finally, number 14, baby. Another 60, but I'll take it. I'll take it. I knew this would be a hot spot for contact. But it took a while to get one to full on commit then. But that one absolutely, has another one just whacked it then. Come on, come back for it. That bar over there has got some fish on it. Got a lot of fish on it. You guys got whacked again. Very next cast. That's a good fish. Oh, that hit so hard. There's a good fish. That pull drag straight away. Oh, I've got to have my drag loose then. Please be a good fish. Feels good. It feels heavy. Man, that pull drag as soon as it hit, that's a good fish. Oh, loosen that back off a bit more. That was awesome, that hit it and just right pulled drag. That's my last fish. It's not that big, it's just not that big. <laughs> I've got everything stuck everywhere, haven't I? Just grab it, it's nowhere near as big as it felt when it first hit, man. That hit like a freight train there, and that was so cool. Just a very, very, very strong fish. Might go a double actually. That might, yeah. Whoa, soaked me. Yeah, I'll give that. I'll say that's probably a double. Man, just started this drift. Bang. This bad boy. Nail it. Easy player. Easy player. Yeah, that's probably a double. Oh, there we go, guys. Another decent one. Same jerk bait. It's all I've used. That's fish number 15. Beauty to finish the day off that. Hopefully, anyway, we'll get some more. But if that's the last fish, I'll take it. Probably mid-80s, I'd say. So lightly hooked as well. So yeah, no giant, 84 centimetres, but she's thick, she's meaty, and it's a nice fish. So yeah, let's get this back, get another one. See you, babe. Yes. Oh, man. The way that ran when it hit them was so good. I normally have my drag rocked super tight. I'm lucky I didn't then because it just plowed as soon as it hit. <laughs> oh, okay. That's going to be the best hit of the day. Absolute donkey. That's probably one of the better ones that I've seen following before. That was so cool. That was, oh no. 
Oh no, that was fucking wild, man. <laughs> Absolute nailed it. Oh, decently fish as well, to be fair, that. Boom, boat side. Oh, that's why I really love fish. You don't get that with bait fishing, do you? Oh man. I can't believe that came off, that was pinned that, I got a rat hooked on him. But I didn't have anywhere to run I suppose. Oof, boat side slam like that, ah, oh, can't beat it. All right guys, not long left to fish now, for only 30, 40 minutes, just gonna slowly drift back down to the boat house. Awesome days fishing though, did not expect this, like I said at the beginning, my goal was four pike today. And we've exceeded that, 15 pike, must have been must have lost uh, the same amount add follows off countless fish like so many fish moving but yeah it's been awesome the only bait they wanted was this <laughs> custom jerk i think this might be the only one of these in this color um i know ross didn't make that many of them but yeah they've hammered it they chipped a few bits off on this side and everything that last bit that last hit i just had now was mega but I probably will get some more fish, so after this outro, if I get some more fish, there'll be some more fish I'm, I'm going to put them in, so yeah, 15 so far, hopefully we get uh, 16, 17, 18, who knows, but yeah, it's been an awesome session, hope you guys enjoyed, it's probably going to be a long video this one, but uh, yeah, Joe bait fishing, you can't beat it, so yeah, catch you guys next time. There's a fish. Is it? If it is, it's really small. Is that a fish? That can't be a fish. Can it? Is it? It is! <laughs> Number 16. Didn't even fight. <laughs> Buddy. He's an alley looking dude. I can see why he didn't fight. He's choked that jerk bait. Okay. Right in my thumb. But uh, yeah, Pike 16. Now we're looking little guy. He's got a few scars on his back and everything. But uh, oh, see you, bro. <laughs> Didn't realise that dude was hooked. I just felt the weight of him. <sighs> Number 16. <laughs>